Eh waku 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 waku. <laughs> you guys by the way jamaa anaitwa Shadi Kim. Shadi Kim very nice good friend of mine. And uh, anakuaga na advice nyingine poa sana. Um, see, we have met s- several times. The first time to limit net limit net Dubai and then to commit name Tani pale Nakuru ako na shop ya kuza uniform so ukiwa pale na kuru and you are looking for school uniform tafuta shadikim ako na shop pale and kama uko majuu pia unatafuta maybe someone to send ka gift apeleke mtu wako shadikim is your guy unaweza mtafuta na kama uko mtaani unataka travel kwenda dubai shadikim anaweza kusaidia but before that kuna time nime break nikaenda mtaani Yeah, I took a break of one year and I came back. Yeah. So, Joyo story. Let's do this. Let's watch this video ya Shadi Kim and then we come back to one reason ya watu kurudi golf ni nini. Viewers, let's watch this video. Video bwa me pasi here. Let's watch it. And we will see how we talk about it. Let's watch the video just a minute. Let's watch it. Ah, waku 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 eh. Kuna swali moja nimekuwa nikijiuliza for a long time. Najiuliza, kwa nini we watu wenye wako gaf ndio wanakoniwa sana wakirudi mtaa? Eh? Na ndio, maisha yao inaenda inawapiga chenga huko unapata wamerudi gaf tena. Utasikia ati mtu ametoka US, ametoka Europe, ameenda airport, amenyang'anywa pesa airport, sio amefanya nini? Kitu ya kwanza unajua ni nini? Sisi watu wenye wako gaf tumetoka ina very very humble background. Hiyo na ni kweli. Mimi before sikuwa ishika 50,000 imeshikana hivi. Sikuwa ishika na si uongo na watu wengi sana hapa hawaja hawako ishika before kuja gaf. So ukikuja gaf kuna ile unapata tu pesa una sacrifice ukiomba Mungu wako, una save, unajipata umeenda mtaa na like 200, 300, 400 depending na mahali Mungu amekuwezesha kusave, kusave. Niliwaambia save usiwaji compare na mtu saving inategemea na mahitaji yako na venye familia yako iko sisi wengine ni ndio sisi breadwinner kwa familia ndio tunasomesha watu watoto wetu huko wa wengine brother zetu sister zetu wadogo so ukijikombea na mtu utapotea watu wengine wamekuja huku kupiga sherehe peke yake anyway ndio unapata watu wakienda mtatu uko na 200000 he he ile excitement na kushika Unaona hiyo pesa haitawaisha in your life. Unaona? Alafu au kwa na good plan, unaenda kufanya hivi. Unapata ma best sasa hiyo hata ma best ndio nakugojeanga. Eh mkuu, eh hey, yeye yeye tumekumiss, tumekuhata muda. Eh najua ume uko nazo mbaya sana. Wanakupeleka hivi wanakuchafua. Hao ndio unawachafua pesa inaisha. Na unajua hao wamezoea life mta. Si kama wewe. Wewe sasa hiyo after miaka mbili kurudi mta utaenda huko ukwe kama mlevi ushiki rada ya venye maisha iko so pesa ikiisha unafikiria anga tu kurudi gaf unaona utapoteza na wa, na mabeste kwanza hm alafu bad advisor hapo ndio unapata nga watu wanaku advise fanya hivi nunua shamba nunua gari nunua fanya hivi weka biashara fanya mpaka unachanganyikiwa na ndio nasemanga kuwa na kuwa na one side ufocus na kitu moja ukama uko na pesa sema hii pesa nataka kwenda kufanya hivi before hata u meet my best before hata ufanye kitu yoyote home enda ufanye hiyo kitu ulisema kama ni shamba enda uangalie shamba ulipe hiyo pesa uhakikishie hiyo pesa imeisha alafu sasa ukuje ku meet my best ushamaliza na, na, na shamba unaona before u meet my, before u meet my best uki meet my best before ununue ufanye kitu au utafanya hiyo kitu watu wako na advice mtaa wewe unapewa advice fungua hii biashara hii biashara iko na pesa wekelea hapa weka kwa best fanya hivi unaona pesa wote inaisha ikiisha unafanya nini unarudi soko soko ni wapi gaf unaanza kutafuta ma, ma passport niliweka wapi pesa imeisha mm. na wao mabesti wenye wanakukula do hao wamezoea maisha pesa yako ikiisha wao wataendelea na maisha yao vizuri sana wewe wewe ndio maisha yako ita itasimama juwewe saka bro uuelewe u- u- maisha mtaa venye iko ah utapigwa stake sana nayo maisha anyway hiyo excitement ndio inafanya watu kwanza wapoteze pesa sana 
juu umeshika pesa moja mara moja pap uh, unaona umeenda ukapata account yako iko na 200 300000 na hujai kuwa na pesa kama hiyo hujai sikia pesa kama hiyo so unaona hiyo pesa haitawaisha wewe unatumia unatoa 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 na unajua kutoa sio kurudisha kutoa 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 unapata hauna yeni wewe mimi nakumbuka 2000 uh, nilienda vacation yangu 2014 ya kwanza ya pili nikapiga 2016 ya kwanza sikuwa na do nilikuwa na i think 280 lakini nilifanya kitu madhali nishika mateka mpaka nikanunua caprot hiyo time unaona from there vacation ya pili nilienda na 1.3 hapo ndio nilishika milioni yangu ya kwanza we eh kenya hakuna mahali sijai enda ile excitement ni mimi ni milionaire ili nipiga waku ai 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 ule demu nilikuwa na yeye hiyo time ah suruali alikuwa inachafuka anatupa hawezi osha <laughs> god have mercy upon us <laughs> moja ina ina inabomolewa ashukwe ingine waku we hiyo excitement is yai nipiga vibaya sana anyway sitaki kupeana hiyo story sana juu na naezalia hapa juu hiyo story huwa napeana nasikia vibaya sana lakini ni life waku ukipoteza wacha kukumbuka wacha ma regret hiyo story iliisha na niliitoa kwa mind zangu lakini huwa nakumbukanga saa zingine lakini si ni life waku hakuna mtu hajai cheza na pesa yake ukapiga sherehe mpaka ukajisahau baadaye ndio unakumbuka gani nimefanya ni huyu ujinga gari nimefanya lakini ukirudi sasa gaf ndio unajipiga una ngati mani what have you done umefanya ujinga gani sasa lakini pesa ishae ishaenda hiyo opportunity ishatoka sasa ndio unaanza nga huku ukae chini uji organize sasa uanze mambo mambo yako tena unaona so hiyo excitement alafu ile kuongea sana Duko na tupesa umesave pesa unaanza kuambia mabeste hai mimi hata niko na 300000 ukidhani unajitengenezea jina hao watu wanakugoja mtaa nilisema information zingine you don't have to share unaenda lini unaona unafika saa ngapi utagoja mtu utapata mtu amekugoja mtaa hao mapasta wa online unawaelezea your life kila kitu ati umesave pesa ngapi unaenda saa ngapi hao ni wakora wengi ni wakora Unakutana umegojoa airport unafunikwa na zile madawa za kulala unabebwa Unaona pesa zako zinafurizwa Unabaki bila kitu kama ule demo alifanywa hivyo Ati amewekelea kwa pasta huko ati uh, pasta ata, watapata na airport pasta you don't trust your people Trust watu wenyu hata wacha hadi hata watu wenyu wakuibie kuliko mtu wa nje mtu ujui una trust mtu online kama una akili Tumia akili mkuu, akili muhimu sana. Eh? Na online dating unapendana na mtu online, unamwekelea mpaka maisha yako ukienda mtaa, hamjai patana. Usiwahi jaribu ujinga kama hiyo. Unaona? Trust mingi waachana nayo ya mtu ujui. Eh? Hiyo ukuzi wacha, juu utakoliwa na huyo mtu akutoke. Patana na huyo mtu, after umeenda mtaa ukakaa kama wiki na familia enda na yeye sasa patane na yeye na usiende kwake mpatane mahali wewe ndio utamwambia mahali mtapatana mpatane hapo mpige mambo yenu unaona lakini wewe usimpatie pesa zako madeal mingi wacha pesa kidogo lakini joto mingi wacha na nayo eh na deal mingi za mtaa wacha 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 kabisa madeal wacha na nazo hizo zitakupoteza maisha yako itabadilika vibaya sana anyway hizo mambo hizo mambo ndio zinafanya watu wa gaf umeenda umepiga sherehe tena unaanza kulia ukisema heri nirudi gaf unakuja kama ex gaf mimi nasema ngai heri uvumilie gaf upige hata miaka kumi na upige 20 years ukitoka tu utoke one hautaifikiria mambo ya gaf lakini watu wengi wanakuwa na pressure wacha nirudi mtaa sitai rudi gaf kwanza wanaongeanga watu wenye wanaenda mtaa wanaongeanga sana na sita irudi gaf gaf ni waste of time sijui agado wewe acha upige mwaka mtaa hmm? usote 
Yes. Si hivi hata ningekuwa gafu watoto wangu wangekuwa naishi poa. So mkuu jipange. Tumia akili yako vizuri. Wacha kushia your information. Wacha kushia your information. Mingi. Alafu watu wengi wajuangi ni nini wanaenda kufanya? Kuwa focus. Jua ni nini unataka kufanya before utoke gap. Kuwa na kitu unataka kufanya na usienda kubadilisha mawazo na watu huko Kenya. Juu watu ni wajanja huko Kenya. Wanataka kule kula do, wakikupea maidea, wachana na hizo idea zako. Mimi nasema anga mtu mzuri, unaenda anga mtaa, unajifanya fala kwanza. Jifanye fala, ingiana na hao watu wa nduzi, ingiana na wa mama wa soko huko. Eh, hey, jifanya una pesa, jifanya hata ulidipotiwa, pesa zako uliwacha huko. Wewe uko na pesa, lakini unajifanya ujui anything au una do. Unajifanya tu fala huko. Unapiga kama mwezi moja, miezi mbili. Eh, wewe si unajua venye unataka. Wewe ukipiga hizo miezi utakuwa umejua biashara yenye poa, inaingiza pesa, utakuwa unajua Kenya unaweza fanya ikuletee do. Na juu uko na do, sasa hiyo hata ukiinvest hautapoteza sana. Utakuwa poa, juu umefanya research kwa ground. Research ya ground na research ya online ni different. Different sana. Ni different sana. Usidanganywe na mtu. Eh, hey, noma sana. Anyway, much love and God bless you. Wacha tuchanuke. Share hii video. Watu tuchanue watu wengi. Eh, hey, wasipoteze ndo zao. So guys, I hope umewatch video mpaka hapo pale Shadikimo amemalizia. So, Shadikimo anasema ukweli by the way. Hizo nenye watu sana sana wanarudi golf. Why? Why do so many people wenye wameshaacha job? Then I will be wanapiga maybe one year, two years on the golf. So Shadikim is right. Unapataga sometimes uh uja tengeneza ile foundation poa. Maybe you have, you had planned kwanza kabiashara, biashara in enda in a fail, which is it's good. Actually you are better than that person when I when Aj left. Aj left golf. You are better than that person who meenda ukapata experience. Now you went back to restructure. It's good. It's very good, by the way. Mtu asiwe kuambia ati sasa uone aibu. Ati sasa mimi nilifail, nilisha toka kampuni. Siyezi taka kurudi kwa yu kampuni tena. Ama siyezi taka kurudi golf. Watu wataniona aje, watu wetu wataniona aje. Wacha waonge. Wacha wakuone. At the end of the day, wende umevayo kiatu. We unajua mali na kufinya and you know why you're going back. So, kurudi kwa ni unashida gani? Nika kufuto from this company and you are changing company. Who, what is the problem? Kenya ni otongapi wana chaka kazi ni wana change company. Hapa Gulf, let's assume Gulf ni company. So nilitoka, nili exit company and then I went back to work. What is the issue? Rudy, fanya kazi, tafuta do. Same thing, presidents, MPs, wana fail this term. Next time wana jaribu. Next time wana jaribu. Mbaka wanakujua wanakuwa ma president, wanakuwa ma MP, wanakuwa leaders. So, mtu wa siwe kuambia ati usi rudi. We rudi. Na, the other thing is, my reason ya kurudi is not your reason. Na, maybe nilienda kujaribu something else. I didn't go to try to start a business. Maybe I went to try to start a, a family and it failed. I went to try a business, it failed. I went to try out to, for a new job, it failed. There are so many reasons. My reason is not your reason. So, wish you the best, guys. Come on, come tani, and you feel go down. Na opportunity to go to golf, Rudy, either the same company or another company. And the last advice: Come on, go company poor. Come on, go company poor. You're not being mistreated. Usi why to sim to when you're leaving? Don't bang the door when you're walking out. Usiwambi wa dosi ati hata hii kampuni ya ikuwa inisaidia na kitu. Ati haa, siju ye, Mr. Wairudi, no. Peacefully walk out, resign, accept, go, jaribu vitu zako one month, two month, three months, if they don't work out, talk to your boss. Mwambi, eh, mini lijaribu wa ikuwak. You can take me back, well and good. Rudy, get your structure, start from where you stopped or where you failed, you, just a lesson, dust off yourself, and move on. That's how I say. See you next time. Cheers.